Sun is the star at the center of the solar system. It is an early perfect sphere of hot plasma with internal convective motion that generates a magnetic field via a dynamo process. It is by far the most important source of energy for life on Earth. Everything that has come from the sun for life of the sun is constant. Of course, there are solar flares and prominences of the sun that sort of like shake the seat, the field, but you are always held by the presence of the sun. Earth rotation is the rotation of planet right around its own axis. Earth rotates eastward in progressive motion. As viewed from the north, pole star flourish, Earth turns counterclockwise. The North Pole, also known as the Geographic North Pole or Terrestrial North Pole, is the point in the northern hemisphere where Earth axis of rotation meets its surface. This point is distinct from Earth's North Magnetic Pole. The South Pole is the other point where Earth's axis of rotation intersects its surface in Antarctica. Earth rotates once in about 24 hours with respect to the Sun, but once every 23 hours, 56 minutes and 4 seconds with respect to other distance and stars. Earth rotation is slowly slightly with time, thus, a day was shorter in the past. This is due to the tidal effect to the Moon has on Earth rotation. Atomic clocks show that a modern day is longer by about 1.7 milliseconds than a century ago. Slowly increasing the rate at which UTC is adjusted by leap seconds. Analysis of historical astronomical record show a slowing trend of about 2.3 milliseconds per century since the 8th century. There are some effects of Earth rotations. Number one, rotations creates a diurnal cycle of light, darkness, temperature, and humidity changes. Number two, rotations requires the creations of standardized time zones. There are 24, one of each hour of the Earth's rotations. Number three, rotations cause the tides. The twice daily rise and fall of sea level. Tides are complicated because they are the result of both the gravity of the moon and the moon are lined up with the earth, but most of the time they are not. Tides are highest when the earth, suns, and moon are in a straight line. Number four, the Coriolis force. Rotations cause a deflection of ocean and air currents. The earth rotates much faster than the winds or currents move. This causes a large deflection in the direction that winds move and ultimately results in rotation around low pressure cells and the high pressure cell. It also causes large rotation pools of water in the oceans called gyres. The Coriolis force only occurs on large features. The rotation of Earth causes several illusions. Number one, the sun appears to move across the sky each day from east to west. Number two, the moon appears to move through the night sky. Number three, the stars appear to spin around polaris in the night sky. And all of these are examples of apparent motions that means they are not really occurring. The motion that is occurring in reality is the Earth's rotation. Since all of these motions are caused Earth's rotation, they all appear to move at the same speed as the Earth. Number one, the sun moves 15 degrees through the sky per hour. Number two, the moon moves 15 degrees through the sky per hour. Number three, the stars spin around polaris 
15 degrees per hour. And what makes the sun seemingly disappear at night is the Earth's rotation or training motion. Whichever part of the Earth is facing the sun, the time is experienced. For the rest of the world, it's night. As the Earth continues to turn the day side, turns away from the sun, giving the impression that the sun is going down. This is known as sunset. And sunrise is just the exact opposite when the night side gets nearer the sun's direction. Point is, sun doesn't hide anywhere, but the earth is round and it takes 24 hours for it to rotate around its axis. Half the time sun is in the visible part, where as other time, when it is not visible to us, it is visible to someone else on the earth. So, if it is 12 o'clock in the night, here in India is 12 o'clock afternoon in America. So, it's not the sun that's going away exactly, but it's that the earth you're standing on is spinning. And the spot you're standing on spins away from the sun.